Sucks anyway. Oh, that's true. No. I'm not happy. No, you can't just take me if I don't want to. Yes, I can. Because Julie, don't be selfish, girl. So much. Well, not so much. Who would be happy being just a head, dude? Yeah. No offense. No, offense. I would let him die, honestly. Dang. All right. <laughs> He's right. What kind of life is he gonna live? Like, yeah. or at least find a body to like replace. Yeah. I am, I am an innocent 
born in Bobby Church. The fuck? <laughs> I saw, I saw like a conspiracy mm -hmm. um, video about um, Scientology, like you know the Church of Scientology, right? And like how they're really weird. And they'll they'll get celebrities to join the church because that's how they want to get the word out. Mm -hmm. There's a conspiracy theory that Scientologists, like or some people working for Scientology, killed um, Philip Seymour Hoffman. Why? Because he portrayed, he was in a movie that was like, that was about My cultish kind of thing, and mm -hmm. it was, no it was very, songs. like, it was very similar to Scientology, and he portrayed it, you know, it was portrayed as him being in a cult, uh -huh. and so <laughs> there's a conspiracy that they had something to do with his death, but everyone's like, nah, he just, he just I hope you work things out nah, he overdosed on heroin, dude, yeah. Which is crazy, but he, he was an actor was, too. Yeah, he was clean for like ten years. I'll cover you I'm out of ammo. Yeah, no, I don't know. If you guys don't know who he is, he's a guy in um the Hunger Games. Yeah. Hunger Games, the Hunger Games, the Hunger Games. And I think he won like one or two Oscars. Yeah, beforehand, he's always just been an actor. So, I mean, so I don't know if Scientology. I don't know if the Scientology first had anything to do. with but I, they are a little freaky. I love the theory. Oh me. I just like the theory. Yeah, there is a bunch. It was like a it was a video on Hollywood Conspiracy. Uh there was another one. Um Oh the that the whole like Bruce Lee's death was mm -hmm. the Chinese mafia. That was one of them. Well we'll explain well the one that I know the, the oh fuck. Oh, oh. And then we're gonna do like another one where like it falls on me. Uh yeah. oh so they're they're throwing all the enemies in this. Oh boy. Like all the enemies we've encountered so far. Oh fuck, so is this the last phase? And look it might be it might be ending this game soon. We're gonna have to figure out what game we're gonna play next. Yeah. Give us some recommendations. Right, like like uh we have almost every system, so just let us know if there's a certain game you want us to play. Yeah, please. We like to take recommendations. So, what were you saying about this lady? <laughs> oh yeah, what, what, it, what, I, what the story that I know from my mom yeah. is that the Bruce Lee family is cursed, so every man uh, yeah. dies, like Brandon Lee, the yeah, guy who did the crow, he, he, he died, he in died. The movie. yeah, he died while filming the movie because they shot they, him. This, it was a scene where they shot him, where yeah. they killed his wife, or fiance, whatever the fuck, mm -hmm. they, um, they put like, Supposedly, it was a fake bullet, but um, it has to be a real one on yeah. accident. I don't yeah. know how you actually put a real bullet in a gun. Is exactly. it supposed to be a fake gun? Exactly. But anyhow, and it went off and killed him right in the abdomen. Like, yeah, him, shot him right in the abdomen. Which, uh, but it, what's weird cool. to me is that like it still came out as a movie. So, yeah, yeah. Um, though. So, I don't know. Or they switch the oh fuck! Oh, okay, so yeah, oh. what happened was it's funny. Actually, it's kind of weird how I know all this. Uh, what happened was is hold on, keep it open, keep support you, so I don't think it's gonna Um. Um. So yeah. So what happened was the the lady who played his fiance. I should probably shoot him. Yeah. Um. Was totally against the continuation of the pro. But the asshole director was like, no, I already invested a lot of money in this movie, and, um, and I want to continue the, the movie. So then the actress who played his fiance in the film left after she finished that scene where she was murdered. Mm -hmm. And she left. Mm -hmm. Um, and so they, so the guy hired a guy who looked like Brandon Lee, and who looked like... Um, so fiance in the film. I mean, she basically filmed all her scenes anyway. Mm -hmm. But there were certain flashbacks that were still needed. Mm -hmm. oh, okay. And so, oh, you never seen The Pro? No. It's one of my favorite movies. It's really, really fun. Good. You should see it together. They actually want to remake The Pro, mm -hmm. but a lot of fans um, are saying no. It's just like, bringing them to like, 
Yeah. And it's a, and it's a cla it's such a cult classic. It's such a like nineties gothic movie. And they're like, they're like, you know, what the? Oh, it's these assholes again. And they're like, um, they're like, no, leave them alone. Don't, don't redo the movie. I don't think they should redo the movie because, first of all, they continue the movie after he was murdered on set, which I thought was pretty fucked up. It is fucked. Anyway, that's. The entire industry is just mm -hmm. money, yeah. money, 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 money. Oh, basically, yeah. And oh, fuck it, these ass people blow up. Oh, they're like, <laughs> ain't okay. no party like a explosive party, right? <laughs> uh -huh. Okay. Party on. <laughs> oh, okay, God, oh God, oh God, God, oh God. Oh fuck! Oh my god! Oh, the little farmers. Yeah, this is definitely this is the last one. Mm -hmm. Um, no, yeah, like, you can like in at this. Watch out over that. Shoot now. So, yeah. Ah, stop. Yeah. Oh, oh, oh. Gotta go. Gotta go, bud. Okay. Yeah. So yeah, there's like a petition being signed to like not remake the movie because like. If you think about it, Hollywood, Hollywood's been really, really lazy with their movies. They've just been doing remake after remake after remake and like really shitty movies and just like pure. Like Hollywood's at this like, um, oh fuck, I'm gonna get In Hollywood, just like the prime of Hollywood is just these superhero movies. That's what's really keeping the industry going. There, okay, there is, there is an article about. How 2018 is gonna ruin Hollywood? Why? Because there are there are so many blockbusters. There's so many that's gonna there's gonna be a new movie out almost every single. Week. But why? Because I don't know. There's just gonna be so many sequels and you know prequels uh -huh. and all this stuff. And it's gonna be just a lot of Marvel movies, or <laughs> Disney movies, whatever. And it says it's gonna ruin like Hollywood because there's just not gonna be enough time to really Shh. rack up money. Oh fuck. But it's just not gonna be enough time to rack up God. money for each movie, so it's gonna be bad. It's just there's not gonna be enough focus on one movie. Right. But there's just gonna be so many films coming out like I think those zombies were trying to So it's <laughs> Did you hear him? <laughs> Did you hear him? <laughs> no, he did not just say that to us. Oh my god. <laughs> no. Thumbs up for Bukake. Give this video a like if you're down for Bukake. 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 <laughs> I'm not going to put that in the title. <laughs> no, please. I was going to do it. It's called oh, uh, the name of this episode of Bukake, but I was like, you know what? <laughs> I'm not going to go down to that level. No. But thumbs uh, up for Bukake. Uh, we are, wow, we are very, very oh, in. Fuck. We got way too deep Point. there, so we're probably going to end this up. Alright, we're going to end this episode right here. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Yes, thank you. And watch the this. crow. Yeah, yeah, watch the crow. And moral of the story is Bukake. Bukake. Bukake, everybody. Bukake, everybody. Alright, alright. Bukake. Bukake. Bukake.